hair care. Um, I don't have a conditioner. Again, a little bit of a conditioner haul. If it moisturizes my hair, I'm okay with it. But I do have a shampoo. I'll do a video on my hair care routine because I have an obscene amount of shampoos and conditioners. Mm -hmm. But without doubt, the, my favorite thing I discovered this year in sort of terms of hair care and the shampoo I've used the most is Big from Lush. And it is basically a gel with a whole lot of salt flakes suspended in it. And for me, it's great because it dries out my hair and dries out my roots and makes them really that like, texturized and just gives them a bit more volume which you know is all i ever really want from a hair product and uh, it's just awesome and it's kind of funky and unusual and it's fun to use so why the hell not i enjoy that a lot uh, shampoo and conditioner for me shouldn't be any real surprise uh pureology hydrate shampoo and conditioner i've dabbled i tried the bumble and bumble uh, volumized shampoo and conditioner and i do like the l'oreal one that you brought back for me but actually nothing really keeps my hair in as good a condition as, as these because they are sulfate free mm -hmm. and I know the L'Oreal one is also sulfate free but I don't think okay, it's just good. it's no you, you can't compete I mean the price points are vast and like miles apart mm -hmm. and I do think that in this case certainly the price indicates the quality of what's inside so I think uh, the what's it called Everish mm -hmm. uh, shampoo and conditioner that I have that I bought back from London in November uh, would be my favorite hands down. I love it to death, but because I only have had it for two months I mm. can't really say that it's a, a favorite yet mm. um, But it's just I just love how it smells. It's delicious and also just leaves my hair bouncy mm. and like really nourished and yum I love it. It's really good um, Hair oil Moroccan oil light. I've had this for about six years and mm. it's I've still got like a third of a bottle left mm. It's amazing Mine is the L'Oreal Mythic Oil. I got the first bottle in my Ruby box, actually, their very first ever box. Mm. And um, absolutely fell in love with it, repurchased it, will always repurchase it. Leaves the hair really soft but not weighed down in any way. Smells delicious. Oh, um, it's also, I just, yeah. They've now made a Moroccan oil candle. Shut up, <laughs> delicious. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, it's very yeah, different. It's, it's a bit delicious. more like fragrance, mm. like sort of, almost like a perfume. Mm. I don't know where this really fits in, but anyway. Styling product. Yeah, styling product would be the Bumble and Bumble Thickening Creme Contour. Which also smells really nice, actually. And I've mm. made a good dent in this. I use it um, almost every time I wash my hair just to add a bit of... It adds gloss, but also texture at the same time and makes everything just look... I'm always a bit, a bit scared up. of, like, um, solid, creamy products No, but like you just that. melt it in your hands and it okay. just kind of... You want like to sort of run it through? I just kind of scrunch it in oh, like okay. this. Yeah, oh, that's cool. Yeah, which I I've like. heard that's very good. Also, the semi sumo I've heard is yeah, very yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But more hold, I think the semi sumo. Mm. Yeah. Uh, okay, then uh, we got sent this, and um, it's the Pantene Pro V Split End Mender Serum. This is actually a really nice um, serum. I use it after I blow dry my hair, and it just adds a bit of shine, and it smells just pleasant. Smooths over the split ends, I think is. It's what yeah. It look, really I mean, does. it's a temporary kind of fix, but it doesn't mend them. Know that. Don't expect them to be mended. But it's still good. Still good. Like it a lot. I've used it all. Ever since we bought it, I've used it every single time I've washed my hair. My favorite styling product will come as no surprise. <laughs> Tony and Guy texturizing sea salt spray. Mm. It's amazing. Mm. Like I said, I have decided that I love this more than the Bumble and Bumble Surf mm. Spray, which is good because it's cheaper and easily more available. Um, yeah, it's just great. I'm probably down to maybe the last third of the bottle. I use it almost every day, mm. especially in summer because I get my air my hair air dryer a lot um, and it just looks really good when it's got a little bit of the stuff in it and mm. oh, I love it, it's so good. And then my other thing for hair is Batiste Dry Shampoo. Mm. I buy it like probably every six weeks because I go through it that quickly. I love it. It's mm. the best. Sprays. <clears throat> Bumble and Bumble Thickening Dry Spun Finish. I want to use this to show you but this is actually Julia's and I can't because it's so expensive. I keep I mean, it for special occasions. Yours is full, mine's almost half empty. Yeah, so basically, I'm so scared of using it, it's so expensive. It's just, it's a dry spray and it creates fullness and texture and so I kind of spray it into my roots and then do this and then it kind of makes you I haven't like you have been food. able to figure out how to get it to do that for me yet. I'm oh, really? not going to lie, you to give me a tutorial because uh, I've used it but I, I don't know, I don't look, get the Look, I mean there was down. a lot of hype on this and I don't think that it's life changing but it's nice mm. and it, it does add texture, it does what it says on the tin but it's by no means I wouldn't like say rush out and buy this. Well, maybe well, I don't know. See, the next thing that I'm buying based on all the other favorites videos that I've seen over the last two weeks is that Orbe Myself. texturizing spray. Myself. Everyone, Charlotte yeah. Tilbury's interview yeah. with Sally Hughes. She was going mm. off about that texturizing spray, yeah. and 
I it's 14 Mega quid. <laughs> but I don't care. If it does to my hair what it does to Charlotte Tilbury's hair, then yeah. I'm down with it. I will yeah. sell some stuff. Mm. Hairspray. Elnet. Supreme holes. It's good stuff. It smells like my grand, but that's yeah. kind of cool. But it doesn't not? it doesn't um, linger in your hair the smell though. Like no. I've used a can, smell me. You smell delicious. Thank you. Not like El at all. No. And I've used literally and your hair's so actually much really, But you brush it through your hair. Yeah. But I use, really I mean, I mean, a good, like, minute worth I've of I've always spray. used this one. It is the best hairspray, no doubt. Yeah. But the next one that I'm going to try is the Fudge Iced Raspberry and Vanilla. Apparently it smells oh, like... Smells hideous. No, apparently it's delicious. So I'm... I'm going to give it a try. Misha swears by Tresemme um, okay. for the ultimate curl cool hold. So maybe I need to oh, look okay. into that. But yeah. Yeah, it's our friend and she has beautiful, beautiful hair. And whenever like, she curls it, it's The kind insane. of hair where every time we see her, we're like, really? Really? Can you just <laughs> stop having that goddess hair? She did my hair and everyone's hair yeah. for the wedding. She's yeah. a genius with hair. Mm -hmm. Just uh, to squeeze this little late comer in. Um, my Tangle Teaser. Mm -hmm. Again, I use it every single day. It has changed my life. I used to use just a wide tooth comb to brush my mm. hair, which was very painful because my hair is very fine and thin and mm. just useless in general. Um, but this means I don't have to be in pain every time I brush my hair. And it's quick and it's cheap and it just does the job. I mean, it's mm. great. And I've had this, uh, I think, for two years and it's not showing any signs of wear. It's absolutely mm. fine. Um, that is also a game changer as far as I'm concerned. Mm. I think that's it. I've forgotten one thing. Oh. Favorite body scrub, the Sugar Crush from Soap and Glory. Oh, just smell it again. <sighs> I love it so much. This is again my second tub. I've used an mm. entire one up. It. I use it today. Delicious. Delicious. I want to. I actually want to stuff my face into it. I want to eat it. Probably <laughs> shouldn't. Probably would get really ill. Oh, anyway. tools. Um, I just want to say tools. Um, oh. Hair dryer and straightener, both GHD. Um, the GHD Air hair dryer, phenomenal. Also, Parlux hair dryers are very, very good. And Currently on special at Superbless, mm. by the way. And the I only got it for Christmas, but I've used GHD straighteners for forever. Um, and I got the Eclipse for Christmas, and it really is it's pretty pretty amazing. Um, very expensive though. Whew. I don't heat style my hair, so my hair dryer is incidental, and I don't have a hair straightener. I gave it away because you have my, my hair though. doesn't need to be any straighter than it is. I do have a curling wand, my favorite one I've had since I was in varsity, which is eight years ago, and. It is by Revlon, mm. and it was about 200 Rand mm. at the time, and it is amazing. And I bought fabulous ones and other kind of fancy brands ever since, and mm. nothing has come close to the staying power of the curls when I use the Revlon mm. one. Probably fries the hell out of my hair, but I mean, so you do it every now and again. Exactly. I think that's, that's it. it. Cool. Ooh. Okay. I'm tired. Ooh, sorry, that was a long one. <laughs> Hope you're all still alive. Um, <laughs> thanks for watching. Please subscribe and like the video if you are so inclined. Mm. We will see you next time. Bye bye. bye. Thank you.